The Singapore Gold Cup is next as a Group 1 handicap with the odd distance of one mile three furlongs and the top Springfield clan for Vinnie Gerard Alba, Flora, Dan Hughes, Cash Track, David Robertson, Trapango Commodity, Darren Thompson, Hookham, Dan Hughes, Empire of Angels, Paul Rhodes, Nature Queen, Leon Van Rensburg, Black Heart, Joshua Sutherland, Emphasis, Paul Rhodes, Stormbird, Martin Edel, Purple Hero, Munas, Land of Hope, Joshua Sutherland, War Prayers, Leon Van Rensburg and Cloud Walker, Stu Gray. All installed, and away they go. One and three furlongs, in the intermediate trip, and uh, Nature Queen and War Prayers were quickly out, so it was black hard, but the pace doesn't seem all that hot at the moment. Stormbird is also close up, so it's an Empire of Angels looking for an Obi One horse, but we haven't got one. So we're gonna struggle for pace and we haven't got a Derry Hinton either, so it's gonna be Black Heart, the nose banded Joshua Sutherland horse that goes on. And he's going to lead by a bat three lengths or so from Hookham and Purple Hero in emphasis and cash trap to Pango Commodity. There's about eight or nine of them in a line for second place. And Trapango Commodity and his cash track are going to be the ones that are going to go widest. Also caught a little bit wide is, is the Leon Van Rensburg horse there, War Prayers. But it's Blackheart who's got lead. They're already past the seven pole. Emphasis is in second. Stormbird on the inside is third. Then comes Purple Hero. War Prayers is next. Empire of Angels has got the rail. Being trapped by Alba Flora and Hookham. And wider on the track, Trapango Commodity. The back marker is now Nature Queen. Springfield Clown Land of Hope also towards the rear. But Blackheart leads as they come down towards the five furlong pole. Blackheart then clearing the lead from Stormbird, who's in second. Empire Rangers getting a nice split up the inside. Cloud Walker also creeping into it. Purple Hero still there. War Prayers coming around the outside. But Blackheart still got the lead then. Blackheart past the four with a two length lead from Stormbird in second. War Prayers. And then Cloud Walker, Empire of Angels still going well up the inside. Purple Hero has switched to the outside. Land of Hope and Nature Queen. The two bottom weights are coming from the back. But it's Blackheart who's got the lead. Blackheart then in the lead by about a length and a half. To Empire of Angels in second. Stormbird is in third. They're coming down past the two. And Blackheart kicks on in the lead. Empire of Angels comes to challenge. Stormbird is there in third. Land Hope, Nature Queen is next. They're coming down the inside the final furlong and a half. And Blackheart is still repelling Raiders. But Empire of Angels. He's starting to wear him down. Stormbird still trying to close in third. Also, Land of Hope trying to run on. So, too, War Prayers are inside the final half furlong. And it's just Empire of Angels. Stormbird, though, now picks up on the outside. And Stormbird has gone into the lead. And Stormbird takes it from Land of Hope. Cloud Walker and Blackheart. And knock me down with a feather. As the commentator finally gets a big race win on the flat this season. Stormbird been struggling in the. Handicaps and comes and pops up and wins a Group 1 handicap. Well, there you go. That's not me down for a bit of a surprise. So Stormbird takes it then for Martin. The Land of Hope for Josh Sutherland was second, who was also third with Blackheart. Cloud Walker for Stu Gray was fourth. And Empire of Angels for Paul Rhodes was fifth. Blimey.